everyone and welcome back to beacons 101 where we give you mini tutorials on all things beacons today we're gonna go over how to add terms and conditions to your beacons digital products now what is the purpose of terms and conditions well in simple terms it is a set of guidelines or rules that can protect you hey. the seller and the people who purchase hey. your products the buyers by clearly defining the relationship between you and your buyers terms and conditions help manage expectations protect your rights, and provide a foundation for resolving any issues that may arise. With Beacons, it's super easy to add terms and conditions. Even my dog can do it. Ain't that right, Coda? Head into Beacons and on the left-hand navigation, click on Store. At the top of the page, you'll see five tabs, and you're going to want to go all the way to the right in the Settings tab. Close to the bottom, you'll see the Terms and Conditions section, right above the Integrations section. Just hit the toggle button to enable it, and here you can add specific terms and conditions that will apply to all your digital products. Some best practices when adding terms and conditions is to emphasize clarity and readability, clearly state what the terms and conditions cover, including the services or products provided, and to regularly update it. When enabled, you'll be able to see the terms and conditions in the checkout page, and by clicking on it, you'll see the info in a pop-up modal. At Beacons, we want to give you and your buyers the best experience. So that is why we have added this feature to make sure you and your buyers are protected and secure. If you want to try this out for yourself, click the link in the description and sign up for Beacons for free. Also, while you're at it, check out our other tools and apps. Make sure to check out our other videos and subscribe to our YouTube. Give us a follow on our Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter. And don't forget to join our Discord. All right, y'all. See you next time.